visuals tell you the actual the actual story what the situation is like this is rajiv chowk area of gurugram you can see what has happened here just after couple of days of heavy rainfall this is the one of the prime locations in gurugram the water is almost knee deep there are traffic jams heavy traffic jams in fact and now since the kavar yatra has also begun now this has become a headache for those people as well those devotees as well who are actually going to haridwar and different places you can see over here this is this seems like something like a, a sangam over here where from three sides water is coming and in fact this is a non motorized tra transportation uh, passive way and in fact you can see this entire area is flooded really badly and in fact this shows one thing the failure of civic authorities in gurugram this is not the very first year when we are reporting such menace from gurugram we have been reporting about this menace uh, uh, we are reporting about this menace from last many years and this year also the situation remains the same and in fact uh, you can see all these people who have been standing here they standard they are they, some of them are trying to make way to work some of them are trying to make um, make way to their home uh, one only small thing we have to remember is that today is a sunday morning so sunday today is a off day for many so this is this traffic is actually very less this is nothing like a usual traffic day so just imagine if situation like this continues for the next few days what will happen on a working day when a lot of people actually commute to get to their workplaces and in fact uh, you can see from here also there are many offices which are located just um, on that side of the road i i can't even go to that side that side is almost water logged above my knee level so you can see the you can imagine the plight of people and in fact imd has went on to predict more rains in delhi and cr region and in fact earlier also uh, an alert was issued by imd in fact uh, earlier the alert was yellow then it was upgraded to the orange alert now orange alert persists in many areas of north india and in fact this is not the only area which is being uh, affected by these heavy rains other areas of gurugram as well including sona road a o area or the sadar bazar police road they are also suffering with the same issue and in fact you can see how people are actually trying to make way from this very road to the uh, just to the other side these are just couple of 100 me meters which the people have to actually cross but still uh, the situation is so bad over here it's barely imp it's almost impossible to walk on these roads in fact these are the tempo travelers and in fact certain people are helping uh, each other to get out of this place and in fact this traffic goes straight to sector 32 and in fact uh, this stretch is barely 1 km and in fact when we try to reach here it took more than 25 minutes just to cover that 1.5 km area so you can imagine how one of the top class cities of the country is suffering just after um, uh, just after a spell of rains which continued for two or three days now imd has maintained that these rains will continue but if these rains continue you can see what will happen to these places if uh, if the rains continue to batter gurugram and in fact more uh, one worrying situation is also uh, uh, is that medanta hospital is also very near to this very place and in fact this is the very road which actually leads to the medanta hospital just imagine if something like uh, something some emergency arises or in fact someone tries to make way to the hospital how is that person supposed to get to that very hospital or any other place so this is uh, this situation and these visuals actually tell you the story of the civic uh, uh, civic uh, uh, misappropriation over here in gurugram in fact uh, now the civic authorities have to be answerable to why this situation arises each and every year here in gurugram the uh, incumbent government in the state has also answered a lot of question is to why they haven't resolved this situation if this is happening from a very long very 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 long time so now situation is such that uh, all, even a small stretch of 1 km it will take around um 25 to 30 minutes to cross this area and um, you can just imagine the plight of people over here who are trying to just move from one spot to another and in fact this is a, a weekend i would like to remind this to our audience just imagine uh, if it if it, it 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 would have been a normal working day the situation will be even worse at this very point well this is gurugram area and in particular the rajiv chowk area in these visuals you can see the kind of water logging which has happened over here after the torrential rain falls of two days and in fact with this water logging one thing is very clear a lot of questions 
will be raised on the civic authorities in Gurugram and Haryana. In fact, people are suffering. There are heavy traffic congestions and traffic jams over here. And you can see till where you can see, you can just see the traffic jams. And in fact, also you can see the water logging. Now, Kavad Yatra has also begun. So that is also another one thing which the authorities have to take care of because Yatris are on their foot moving from one place to another and if this situation pertails, persists, then it will be a real tough job for the authorities to maintain a calm and in fact to maintain the situation over here in Gurugram. NCR is also affected heavily by these people and in fact uh, what we have to understand is that uh, right now what is happening in other parts also is that uh, people are suffering to actually commute from one place to another and uh, um, one major thing is that the IMD has predicted heavy rains in coming days as well. So this situation is not going to die down soon. But what the authorities have to do, they have to check the situation. And in fact, they have to take the strictest action against those who fail to perform their duties.